With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry, and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question, and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Our question is, which compound has planar structure? XCF4, XCOF2, XCO2F2, or XCO4? So we over here are given four options, and we are supposed to tell that which of the following has the planar structure, right? So if we take our first option, we have XCF4. Now we're going to find out their hybridization of steric number by using the formula half of V plus M plus the charge if it's an anion minus the charge if it's a cation. Now V are the number of valence electrons of the central atom. M are the number of monovalent attached to the central atom. If it's an anion, we need to add that charge and subtract if it's a cation. Now over here we have central atom xenon. It has eight valence electrons. Plus it is making four monovalent bonds with fluorine, right? So we have four monovalent fluorine atoms attached to it so this would be 12 by 2 which is equal to 6 right over here it is making four bond pairs that means we have two lone pairs right so what its structure would be its structure would be like this we're gonna have two lone pairs right and then four bond pairs with fluorine right now this is what this is a square planar shape this is what this is a square planar shape that means this particular molecule over here is planar in nature so our first option is one of the op option correct then if we see x e o f 2 now over here again central atom xenon so it has eight valence electrons plus monovalent atoms are only fluorine so plus two right this would be equal to five now over here it is making two and three bond pairs right so it has three bond pairs plus two lone pairs so its structure would be like this we have fluorine we have fluorine double bond oxygen and two lone pairs attached to it right now this is what this is a t shaped structure right now this is not planar hence this is not our option correct then we have xeo2 f2 third is xeo2 f2 so again half of valence electron is in on 8 plus 2 monovalent atoms attached this would be 10 by 2 which is equal to 5 now over here it is making 4 bonds so it, it has 4 bond pairs so it is going to have 1 lone pair so its structure would be like this we are going to have 1 lone pair then 2 fluorines attached like this and double bond oxygen attached like this right now this is what this is a seesaw shape right this is a seesaw shape again it is not planar then the last is xco4 over here it would be half of valence electron and xenon plus zero because we do not have any monovalent atoms attached to it so this is equal to four over here it is making four bond pairs that means it gonna have zero lone pair so it would be tetrahedral So this is tetrahedral and again not planar. So only option that is planar is our first one which is square planar right. So because it is planar in structure right so our answer would be 1. For class 6 to 12 ITG and NEET level trusted by more than 5 crore students. Download doubt and app today.